What's going on guys, Expert Greatness here. And today I've got some Far Cry 3 gameplay for you for Fresh Friday. I know it's a day late, but as you can tell I am sick, as you can probably tell at least. I have a really sore throat. It was even worse yesterday. And uh, so please forgive me if I cough or anything, but uh, pick up two quick kills right there with this AK with like Reflex or Red Dot or whatever it's called in this game. I'm not quite sure to be honest. Um, this is just some multiplayer like TDM footage basically. And um... And I'm using the AK-47. I basically just chose this match because it had a lot of things in it that I wanted to show and stuff. And if you saw from the beginning there, the gun is pretty low recoil, um, which surprised me. I thought it was going to be a little bit more like Battlefield, where the guns just shoot straight up, pretty much on the first bullet. But it's not quite. It's uh, you know, it's pretty low recoil. Uh, not quite Call of Duty low, but it's you know, there it's manageable recoil for sure. And uh, right here you'll see my teammate needs a revive. Now that's not second chance. It's almost like Battlefield where if you die you can be revived for like a little while. But um, I do revive him but I end up dying right here. And uh, and you see the kill cans. It shows the guy's line of sight. And you get to tap X to cling on to life. So like that's basically your final stand or whatever. They still get the kill no matter what. But like I, I knew nobody was going to revive me there. So I stopped hitting X just to respawn faster. And as you can see, the game's really beautiful, but, um, it kind of, when I'm running, it kind of looks like my character's bouncing, you know? It looks like he's bouncing, right? Um, that's, I'm not sure if it's meant to look like that, but I'll tell you what, it, uh, the game is really clunky. This is, uh, this is on console, this is on PS3, and it's, uh, it's clunky. It's, that's probably my worst, uh, like, my biggest complaint about it, is the clunkiness. Uh, it just feels really unnatural like the movements and stuff and uh, I don't know it's it's fresh it's not frustrating but like I don't know it would just be so much better if it had more frames and stuff like <coughs> forgive me to say this but like cod and uh, right here I just get overwhelmed got injured and then I turned around had to reload and didn't have uh, any health and that guy killed me personally um, you know, there's a there's a few things with the multiplayer. It's fun. It's a, it's a little bit fun at first, but uh, I've enjoyed campaign more than multiplayer, and that's odd for me because <laughs> I'm a I'm like a multiplayer guy. And right here, I get double teamed. I couldn't get any shots to connect on the guy in front of me, and this guy came up behind me. I really like how it shows the lines of sight and like which bullets pen uh, hit you and where they hit you and stuff. It's really in depth kill cams. Uh, pretty cool. I've never seen that before. And um, I also like the mini map, it's pretty detailed and stuff. But um those are some things I like. But like I said, I, I really like the uh, the single player more just because this game isn't like it's more about like the story, not really the gameplay in my opinion. Uh couldn't get aim on that guy right there. But um I don't know, I just feel like with the clunkiness and the you know, lack of frames on console at least, uh I'm sure it's a I'm sure it's a better experience on PC. This is probably a better game on PC. I haven't tried it though and I don't know anybody that has. But um, if you have like a decent video card and stuff, uh, it's probably a good. And right here, I get shanked, man. I get shanked. Um, that was pretty funny. I uh, I just ran right into that guy, and then he. I I think you can panic knife in this game, although I'm not sure. I I forgot how it works. This is something I wanted to talk about. You saw me just shooting there. I turn around, go to reload, and then I die. It says I committed suicide. Um, as far as I know, there's not like a fucking kill yourself button. You know what I mean? It's there's not like a a button that you press to kill yourself you just kind of uh it just does that randomly and uh i don't know why i haven't figured out yet but uh i got a little bit mad after that happened so i did a bit of work here and these guys couldn't seem to kill me but uh that guy that i just killed got revived and i killed him again and then i killed his buddy in just a second here but um yeah i don't know that's uh that's another thing that's annoying about the multiplayer is just you know, unexpectedly, just randomly, you're just gonna die from suicide once again. It's really odd. And, uh... <coughs> I got snuck up on from behind right there. Sorry about the coughing, guys. Like I said, I am sick. Um... But yeah, like I said, this game is one that I... If you want it, uh... You know, you, should, you shouldn't be looking forward to the multiplayer, probably, because it's not that impressive, in my opinion. A bit disappointing. Uh... Although, I'm pretty sure I... They weren't really going for like a great multiplayer experience. It's more of like a single player game with a, a type of like a role playing first person shooter aspect and, and open map and stuff. And that's pretty cool. But this is cool. 
this is a cool thing about the multiplayer. At the end, you get to show mercy if you win or um, punish. And I clicked punish here. For my punishing move, I get the nut shot. So, uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this fresh Friday. And hopefully soon I'm feeling better so that I, you know, can do more commentaries and such. But anyways, hope you enjoyed and peace.